Kenny wasn't like the other kids. Remote control. TV mattered. Nothing else did. Remote control. Girl said yes, but he said no. Remote control. Now he's got his own game show. Remote control. And now it's his basement, his rules, his game show. He is the quiz master of 27. We'll be called Blaine. Over, gang! Woo! Whoa! Thanks, huh? Uh, I know, it's just him. Uh, oh, man. Don't ever date a big blonde guy. All right, say hello to the Vin Man over here. Yeah! Vin Man is a bagel maker. Hey, you don't, you don't know Cher, do you? What? You know, Cher, yeah, just a little bit, yeah. And say hello to Michelle in the middle. Michelle's from Tenafly. She's a student slash waitress slash newspaper reporter. Woo! On the end is Mark. Yeah! Mark is a recent college grad. Wish them luck. Okay, that's how we do it. We got nine channels, a whole bunch of questions. You guys, I suppose, have some answers. Enough of them will get you a whole bunch of prizes, which are waiting for you behind that wall, all right? Mark, you're in control. Pick away. To the channel four, please, Ken. You got it, buddy. To pay or not yeah. to pay? That is the question. Pretty self-explanatory. and Tory. Here we go, five points. Ricardo Montalban. Mark. To pay. You got it, five points. <laughs> Okie dokie. To pay or not to pay, Dudley Moore. Mark. No to pay. Right, no to pay. That is his real name. Let's that baby out. Woo, yee, 15 points. Dead dog food salesman, Lauren Green. Vin Man. To pay. It was a to pay, yes. Yeah. Vin Man. Vin Man. Say channel number three, the please, Vin Ken. Man. Channel three, tone deaf. This is a channel that proves, once and for all, white people really can't rap. <laughs> Cole Coolin in a bar, trying to tell some jokes. Homie comes up behind me, he's a kid from different strokes. He put a gun up to my skull, but I dissed his course of action. I housed his head and then he bled. Tell me who played Willie Jackson. Vin Man. Todd Bridges. Todd Bridges, yeah. yeah! <laughs> Yo, you were busy on that one, boy. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. What do you want to do, Vin Man? Stay yeah, boy. Okay. I'm going to the channel one more time, Ken. Tone deaf, this time 15 points. Cold cooling at a boy playing Scrabble with the German when his homie staggers in and says, Hello, my name is Herman. He was green and seven feet tall. All the fly girls were a pool, but he was good to go. Had a TV show. Tell me, what was it called? Mark. The Munsters. Yeah, 15. <laughs> okay, 30 points in the lead. Let's, let's uh, go to channel eight, please. Okay, channel eight, reruns. <laughs> Five points. Hey, on eight, is enough, on eight is enough, how many kids did Tom and a Vin Man? One. No, Abby Bradford, Mark. Eight. No, Abby Bradford produced together, Michelle. None. Right, n none. <laughs> Abby was Tom's second wife, his first wife was Joan. Mom to eight is, of course, dead. Okay, go ahead, Michelle. We're gonna stick with, stick with me. Okay. Yeah, good. I know, it's, it's the air in the building. <laughs> 10 points. BJ and the Bear pitted a guy and his chip against smugglers and white slavery thugs. But what was BJ's real job? Michelle. Cop. No, he was not a cop. Mark. Truck driver. He was a truck driver. Ten points. <laughs> Any other lead, Mark? Right. Let's close that baby up. Okay, reruns. This is 15 points now. Patrick McNee was the dapper British spy and the only actor to appear on every episode of The Avengers. Name his character. Okay, Mark. John Steed. John Steed, yes. Very good. Very good. 
That's like almost real trivia there, man. Let's go to Channel 9. Channel 9, really bad TV. These are questions about shows worse than Three's Company. Here we go, five points. The sensational, shocking, wonderful, wacky 70s was a lousy TV salute to a lousy decade hosted by which of Cher's husband? Sonny Bono. Yes, Vin Man, yeah. Sonny Bono. So I'll say with Dick Clark. Switch to channel number seven, Ken. Channel number seven, Bald Guy. Yeah. Five points. Hey, what NFL team did Bald Guy Terry Bradshaw lead to four Super Bowl mark? Pittsburgh Steelers. Yes, Pittsburgh Steelers for Super Bowl victory. 60 points now, Mark, go ahead. Let's stick with it. Stick with the ball game. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Cut yourself off there, Mark. Ten points. Here we go. We first came to know this bald Oscar winner as Bond. James Bond. Name the Scottish actor, Mark. Sean Connery. Yes, Scottish actor is Sean Connery. Ten points. Let's close out the ball, guys. <laughs> okay. Oh, wow, Mark's getting funky. Here we go. You know, they start getting real comfortable. They start playing with the pillow. They're like, it's their basement. And Colin, whose basement it's is it? It's your basement, Ken. And Alicia, whose rules? Thank you. Everybody knows. Yeah, good. 15 points. What was the name of Steve McGarrett's chubby, bald, and oriental arch enemy on Hawaii 5 -0? Mark? Wolfat. Yes. Oh, Very good. Yeah. Woo -hoo. Let's go to channel six, please. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Five points. Hey, which odd couple character shares his last name with our kooky fourth president? Vin Man. Madison. Oscar Madison. Yes, okay. Yeah. Five points. Yes. The Vin Man. The Vin Man. The Vin Man. Hey, Vin, how do you feel about Bialis? Are they like a total waste or what? They are a total waste. They're like rolls. Yeah, They're I hear you. Go ahead. Okay. I'll take channel number one, please. Channel number one, Celebrity Square. Yeah. You know, we couldn't afford all nine, so the object here is to get one square across, up and down, or diagonally. And here is our not-so-secret square, Rose Marry Me. Hey, Ro. Hi, Peter. How are you? I couldn't be finer if I put effort into it, Ro, but thanks for asking. Hey, Ro. Yes, Peter. What exactly is a midrash? Well, I don't know. I, I, I got mine from a sailor in Tijuana, and boy, it's driving me crazy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Ro, you always slay me. But seriously, Ro, what is a midrash? Midrash, it's a city in Morocco. A city in Morocco. Agree or disagree, Vin? Disagree. Disagree. Boom, you're right. It's a religious book, x yeah! Square. You get 10 points. Yeah! All right, Vin Man, 45 points now. Okay, let's go. Excuse me, Vin. Yama. Can you come up and help me apply my anti-itch cream? Oh, to the affected area, I assume. Okay, that means only one thing. Ma's got a rash, and you got some snacks. So put your little balls on your heads. And while you guys are snacking, let's quickly check the points. Mark in the lead with 85, Vin Man 45, Michelle's got five. Round two is coming up. The person left standing after that whole thing can take home all these things. From Casio, the IF8000 Digital Diary. You can actually write in the screen of the unit and it stores all your data, including memos and drawings. It's a calculator, too, from Casio. It's a collection of MCA CDs, including the latest hits from such artists as Jody Watley and Bobby Brown. Lone Star for the latest in telecommunications, featuring memory phones, speaker phones, answering machines, and the all-new Interworks phone. Lone Star, quality phones to fit your needs. From Casio, the TV500, a mini color television that fits right in the palm of your hand. It battery operated so you can take it anywhere only from Casio. One remote control.
resistant color tough for nails and feather light color soft for lips. They come in your size and colors and they match. Introducing Turbo Graphics 16, the next generation video game system. It's four times faster, so the games are more exciting. There are almost ten times as many colors, so the arcade quality graphics are even more intense. And you can expand your system with a CD player for CD games with sound effects that are turbocharged. Turbo Graphics 16 from NEC, the higher energy video game system. Introducing the Adidas Torsion Basketball Shoe. Moves the way your foot moves. Created with one thing in mind. Winning. If you really want it, you can. Adidas Torsion. Welcome back to the only game show that's pre-mixed and disposable, remote controllable. Thank you. Nice call. Okay, it's time to play round two. In this round, uh, the points happen to be doubled. I don't quite understand why, but they are. And you got to watch out for off the air. Other than that, same thing. Vin Man, you're in control. You got 45. Mark's going to lead with 85. Michelle, five. Go ahead, Vin. Take channel number three, please, Ken. Channel three, I Love Lucy. Yeah! Ten points. Which came first? I Love Lucy, Kool-Aid, or the Pap Smear? Vin Man. Kool-Aid. No. Mark. I Love Lucy. No. Pap Smear. Excuse me, what? The Pap Smear. Oh, that's what I thought you said. The Pap Smear, all right. Pap Smear. Six, Kool-Aid, 1927, I Love Lucy, 1951. Very good, Michelle. Go ahead. Let's stick, let's stick with I Love Lucy, Ken. Okay, here we go. Long before Paul Newman's own hit, own, Paul Newman's own hit the shelf, Lucy and Ethel tried to sell their own bottles of what? Michelle. Uh. No. <laughs> Mark. Salad dressing? Yeah, salad dressing. Pretty far. <laughs> The you have to, pardon my syntactical little stumble there, a little syntactical problem. Go ahead, Mark. Let me have channel seven, please. Okay, channel seven, prime time. Here we go, ten points. Whiny teen actress Elisa Milano plays Tony Danza's whiny kid on what series? Mark. Who's the boss? Yes, ten points. Go ahead, Mark. Stick with it, Tim. Prime time now, that. 20 points. Fred Savage sounds like the name of a heroic TV detective, but it is actually Vin Man. For the Wonder Years. Yes. Yeah. Get out of the series. 20 points. Go ahead, Vin Man. Stick with channel number seven, Ken. Channel seven, prime time, closing it up. 30 points. On Designing Women, how many times has femme fatale Suzanne Sugar Baker been married? Vin Man. Three times. You got it. Three yeah. times. Very good. Vin Man, go yeah. ahead. Channel number nine, please, Ken. Channel number. Yeah. Nine, sing along with Colin. Here we go, 20 points. Sing the next line of this Cindy Lauper hit. Hey, sometimes you picture me. I'm walking too far ahead. You're calling to me. I can't hear what you said. Then you say, go slow. I fall behind. The second hand unwinds. If you're lost, you can look and you will find that. Mark. Turn up the time. Yeah, that's right. Oh, man. That was, probably the, that was probably the most poignant moment we've ever had on the show. Mark, go ahead. What do you want to do? Let's, let's stick with it, please. Okay. 30 points. Sing the next line of this Elton John hit. And I would have liked to know you, but I was just a kid. You can't burn out long before. Thin man. Nothing. Mark. The legend ever did. Oh. Yeah, 30 points. Go ahead, Mark, you're in control. Uh, 
Sorry, Kyle. Sorry, Kyle. Let's go to channel five, please. Channel five, inside Joe Piscopo. It's time to take a hypothetical trip inside the body of America's most muscular comedian, Joe Piscopo. <laughs> Ten points, here we go. When muscular Joe sneezes while trying to lift a school bus, he slips and fractures his femur. What part of his body is in there? His back. No, what part of his body ends up in a cast? Mark. His arm. No. Michelle. His chest. <laughs> no, his leg o sour's thigh. You're still in control. Mark, go ahead. Let's stick with inside Joe, please. Okay, stay inside Joe Piscopo one more time. 20 points. Here we go. America's favorite funny guy, Joe, has how many huge bulgy biceps? Two. No, I'm sorry, didn't man. Michelle. Four. Right, four. So his arms go his legs. Ah, uh, Vin, ah, uh, you're a pumper. Hey, you're a pumper. You should have known that. Oh, go come on, come on, Michelle. Uh, Ken, let's go to channel three. Channel three. I love Lucy. Thirty points. Her friends thought that it was Ricky's fist. What? Oh, but what object really gave Lucy a black eye? Michelle. His elbow. No. <laughs> oh. Anyone? Vinman stuck Bongo. it. No, no, time was up. A book, time was up, a book. You're still in control, Michelle. Uh, Ken, let's go to channel one. Channel one, taxi. Yeah. Um, in an episode that revealed each character's fantasies, which cabbie fantasized that he wasn't stupid? Mark. Tony. Right, 10 points. Go ahead, Mark. Let's stick with Taxi, please. Stay with Taxi, 20 points. Which homely Taxi character was lucky to have had a blind girlfriend? <laughs> Mark. Uh, Louis the Pope. You got it, 20 points. <laughs> go ahead, Mark. Let's go to Channel 2, please. Channel 2, Gunter's Animal Kingdom. <laughs> it's a visit from that world-renowned animal training lender, Gunter. You've seen him with Ringling Brothers. You've seen him with Barnum Bailey. You've Ladies seen him in downtown gentlemen. bars. I'm not done with the intro. You've seen him in downtown bars. Here he is, Gunter. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Gunter. What, Ken? I thought you were going to do, like, a, at least give the accent a shot. I don't have to have an accent. I'm from Germany. What part? A little town outside of Berlin called uh, Sphinctonia. That's where I'm from. <laughs> right now, the Peruvian bike-riding rodent of death will jump on this bike and ride! Come on, get on the bike. Come on. It's all right, Kenny. One shot from this baby right Gunther! here. Don't do that to the hamster. Well, one shot. No, I'm not going to let you hit a hamster on the show. Ask your question. We're running out of time. Right. All right, what famous singing trio is made up of guys named Alvin, Simon, and Theodore? Mark. The chipmunk. Yes, 20 points. <laughs> what do you want to do, Mark? Yeah, let's stick with it. Let's stick with it. Gunter, do I have just one shot to the side of the head and he rides that bike? Gunter, no! I'm not, I'm not going to let you hit a harmless, is it a gerbil little or a hamster? Tap, it's a gerbil or a hamster? It's a hamster. How can you tell? Uh, Don't answer that. <laughs> no, just ask your question. All right. What uh, two evil and vicious cartoon chipmunks made Donald Duck's life a living hell? Mark. No. Michelle. Chip and Dale. Yes, that's yes. fine. <laughs> Thank you, Gunter. I hope that hip heals. Yeah, see you later, Doc. Over for your Oh, Michelle. I, I, you know, I, I was just getting to know you. That's life, I guess, huh? Time to play Think Real Fast. This is our lightning round, fellas. Ten points each, uh, 30 seconds worth. Uh, to be honest with you, Vin, unless you get up and strangle Mark and answer every question right, I don't see a real chance in, uh, you know. Anyway, but, but hey, anything can happen in TV because of editing equipment. Once again, to try and save you seven bucks, we're going to ruin the ends of some movies. I'll give you the ending, and you give me the movie that I've ruined. For example, if I said Barbara Hershey dies, you'd say Beaches. Okay, here we go. 30 seconds. Clock me. Dustin Hoffman returns to Walbrook. Mark. Freeman. Yes. Melanie Griffith becomes an executive. Vinman. Working girl. Yes. William Hurt chooses Gina Davis. Vinman. Don't know. No, Mark. Accidental toys. Yes. Kevin Costner's dad is resurrected. 
Vin Man. Dream. Yes, the Cleveland Indians win the division. Major League. Yes, Vin Man. Schwarzenegger and DeVito get married. Twins. Vin Man, yes. Two bimbos bring down the British government. Vin Man. So no. No, Mark. Scandal. Yes, Bill and Ted save the world. Vin Man, yeah. But it doesn't really matter. Vin Man, a heartfelt game. Mark, 245 points. Very good. You're going toward the big old bed, buddy, and hopefully most of this stuff. This pyramid of light and sound truly excites all the senses. Whether the neon is pulsating with the music or glowing steadily, Cleo is the ultimate artistic statement in high fidelity by Susina. Full feature and easy to use. This Zenith VCR features on-screen programming, forehead double azimuth video circuitry with five-speed clear slow motion and a remote that controls both the VCR and TV. Hitachi's compact disc changer plays 12 compact discs, has independent disc exchange, three play mode, built-in timer scan and play. Don't stop the music from Hitachi. The Baldwin Explorer portable MIDI electronic keyboard with 16 solo voices, 16 automatic rhythms and built-in stereo speakers from Baldwin Piano and Organ Company. When does the most control? Oh, good, thank you. The Weekend Rock. First on the scene with the news you need to know. This week. It's a week for returns. Terrence Trent Darby returns with a new album. Ex Flash man Joe Strummer returns to the road. And the B 52s are back and riding higher than ever with Love Shack. Definitive, forward, out front. The Week in Rock, Friday, 7.30 p.m., 6.30 Central. Saturday, 6 p.m., 5 Central. Sunday, 1 p.m., 12 Central. And 9 p.m., 8 Central on MTV. At that time, I believe I was out of the loop. No matter what your favorite recipe, it'll always turn out better if you start from scratch. Introducing Dep Everyday Shampoo, expressly created to gently wash away styling buildup. Hey, okay, let's go, Violin. Ma'am, I want you to take your time. If you recognize any of these guys, turn to the left. When I heard the window break, I jumped under the bed. I only saw the boots. Turn to the right. Just the boots, and they were nasty. It's all leather and metal. Yep, I've seen this before. Sounds like a two-man job. Uh -oh. Father and son. Fat boy boots, now lined up at father and son shoe stores. Just make it a couple. So I got a radio around my neck. So what? the world with a cold sore can be very embarrassing, so I don't put up with it any longer than I have to. I use Campofany Cold Sore Gel. It stops the pain and speeds the healing. Campofany Cold Sore Gel helps me face the world. Hi, I'm Paul Grubin from Ramapo Tire. You know, car safety is an important part of your safety. And we here at Ramapo Tire know there's more to keeping your car on the road than just good tires. That's why we've assembled a professional staff that has a combined experience of over 75 years of expert automotive servicing. From wheel alignments to brakes and mufflers to tune-ups, we get your car in top running condition and all repairs are fully guaranteed. So come to Ramapo Tire, where we have your safety in mind. Robin Drax with the best braces and largest selection of musical equipment. Walls of electric guitars from B.C. Rich, Hamer, and E.S.P. and Steinberger. Amps from Marshall, Crate, Laney, and yes, Mace of Boogie. Enter our all-new MIDI high-tech keyboard room featuring emulator, Yamaha, Korg, and Kawhi. Robbie's is the place to buy your drums and your cymbals. Robbie's is crazy, too. Shop around, get your lowest prices, then come to Robbie's for the best prices. Then you're in Mawa. Free booklet. Five points, major, major points. You're in the bed, nine screens, 30 seconds. You get all nine right, you grab this. A trip to the Holiday Inn Craft yeah, Plaza yeah. Cancun. Sparkling clear turquoise waters, white beaches and tropical climate, masterful and impeccable dining, raising service to an art from Holiday Inn Crown Plaza Cancun. Okay, Mark, do or die. Here you go, 30 seconds, nine screens. Here's your peak. 
Okay, good luck. On your mark, get set, go. One, one Bon Jovi, yes. two Tina Turner, yes. three David Bowie. Yes. Four DJ Jazz, best friend, best friend. Yes. Uh, five Brian Adams. Yes. Six Taylor Dean. Yes. Seven Pass. Eight Georgia Satellite. Yes. Nine. Eight cult, seven Culture Club. Yes. Nine, Iggy Pop. Yes! Receive LA Gear, the number one choice in fashion athletic footwear. Designed for performance in hot colors and exciting styles. They look good under pressure. LA Gear. Take control of your life with Zenith multi brand remote control. It operates most brands of TVs, VCRs, and cable converters from the company that invented the remote control, Zenith. It's the remote control Nintendo game, available this December from High Tech Expressions. Losing contestants take home from the Gumi Guys. Gumi friendship bracelets featuring their brand new super colorful Ova Ovas and fashionable woven leather bracelets. Gumi, get them. Promotional considerations provided by Get the Power to Move with the acclaimed wireless remote controller for your Nintendo Entertainment System. Accurate up to 30 feet with a rapid fire mode for super high scores from acclaimed. Dev, young men's shirts with a hint of fun and sophistication. Tasteful yet innovative. When customers are so demanding, the response must be Dev. Sunny Delight Florida Citrus Punk Brand. Morning, noon, and night, nothing delights you like Sunny Delight. Now available chilled and frozen. 